trays. And here's your host, raised in secret by metaphor mantra chanting monks, it's Mark Curry! Hi there and welcome to Catchphrase. Isn't the set very space agey, don't you think? Yes! Yeah, well, I found out why the other day. Apparently, it was built by aliens. <laughs> yeah. They asked them to build something homey and this was their idea of a two-bedroom semi. <laughs> and apparently, these aliens had six legs. Can you imagine the builder's cleavage? <laughs> and they spoke in a strange language of whistles and clicks. So when they were asked how long it would take, they went... <sighs> <laughs> and we've all heard that before, haven't we? Let's meet today's contestants who are dying to play catchphrase. They are Glenn and Linda. Hi there, Glenn. What's Hi, your name you? and where'd you come from? My name's Glenn Pollard. I'm 43 years old from Milton Keynes. And what do you do? I work for a national telephone company. Oh, right. I think we know which one that is, don't we? And you had a nice time in the Emerald Isle, but you got lost, didn't you? I did, yeah. I was uh, rushing to get to the ferry terminal. I was on my motorbike and um, I pulled up to ask directions of this young lad. I got my map out and I could see where the ferry terminal was and I asked him which direction I was facing on this road. And he looked up the road in front of my motorbike and said, that way. <laughs> Only an island. That's why we love them. We really do. Have a great show today. Linda, welcome to the show. Hi, Mark. I'm Linda Fraser. I'm a 42-year-old civil servant from Gravesend. 42 and 43? It's a good mix, this one. And you play darts, don't you? I do. You're on the team? I'm on the team for the New Falcon, the pub where I live. So you're obviously very good. Let's just see your throwing action then, Linda. Let's just see how you do. <laughs> That's my agent sitting on the front row and you've got her. <laughs> well done. Double top. <laughs> You're a good walker, aren't you, Linda? Yeah. A few years ago, I went shopping for uh, some netball bibs for work for the team and I saw a pair of walking boots. And I thought, well, I've seen an advert in the newspaper about a sponsored charity walk up Ben Nevis. So I bought the boots and I did the charity walk and raised £400. Wow, that's fantastic. What about that? Very good. <laughs> Nothing so exerting today. You'll be able to just take it easy and just use your mind. Are you ready to play? Yeah. They're ready to play. Let's play catchphrase. <laughs> OK, in this first round, each catchphrase is worth 100. When you buzz in, make sure you get it absolutely right, because if you're wrong, that gives your opponent a chance straight away to play. And the bonus in this round is worth 200. Ready? They're oh, look, fingers on the buzzers. They're ready. <laughs> Here's that first catchphrase. Glenn. Flying at half mast. Not quite. Linda. Trousers at half mast. It's trousers at half mast. Well done. <laughs> Linda's up and running, and you get first crack at the bonus. Pick a piece of jigsaw, part of the catchphrase will be revealed. <laughs> Clouds in the sky. No, it's not clouds in the sky, but I know why you've said that, and she said something anyway. Glenn, try and get on the board if you can. Here's another catchphrase. Glenn. Alphabet soup. Yes, alphabet soup. <laughs> I'm not very keen on alphabet soup. It's got TCP in it. <laughs> <laughs> OK, Glenn, have I got the bonus? Chief Thundercloud. Chief Thundercloud? Where did that come from? <laughs> is that a catchphrase? I've never heard of it, if it's it is. a brave answer. Good guess. It is a brave answer. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. OK, nothing there, so here's a catchphrase. <laughs> Linda. Locks, stock and two smoking barrels. Very good. Well sorted out, and she made it into the catchphrase. <laughs> OK, Linda, concentrate on the bonus, down to 180 now. <laughs> Eye in the sky? No, very good guess though. Glenn, you're back in. Glenn? Armpit. Yes, armpit, well done. Linda knew it, but Glenn got there first. So 100 to you. And you're on the bonus. Pie eyed? <laughs> no, it's not pie eyed. Linda, do you think you know what it is? Don't tell me. 
No? Yes? <laughs> okay, another catchphrase. The arrow's pointing to the man. So what does he do that's similar to the thing he's standing next to? And they're forks, so there's some food in Glen. Eat like a horse. Yes! <laughs> I practically had to say that catchphrase for you, but you got it. Well done, Glen. You're on the bonus now. Clouded eyes. No, good guess, though. Good catchphrase, but it's not that. So, Linda, you still get a chance at the bonus if you get this next catchphrase right. Here he is, Mr Chips, Glenn. Walking on eggshells. Yes, walking on eggshells. That's what Mr Chips was doing. <laughs> OK, now concentrate, Glenn. The bonus is down to 150. Stormy eyes. <laughs> oh, you're so near. You're so near. I'm surprised you haven't got this. You've got to make it into a catchphrase, though. Mm -hmm. Linda, you're back in. Here's another one for you both. <laughs> Glenn? Taking a liberty. Taking liberties. Yes, well done. <laughs> don't worry, Linda. I still don't think he knows this bonus, but he <laughs> might do. <laughs> Lightning eyes. <laughs> <laughs> How many ladies have you said that to over the years? Do you know you've got lightning eyes? <laughs> <laughs> OK, no, it's not that. Linda, you're back in. Here's your chance. Another catchphrase. <laughs> Linda? Overdraft. Yes, overdraft. Well done. <laughs> so Linda gets a chance at the bonus. Now, come on, Linda. It must be yours. <laughs> if Glenn doesn't want it, it must be yours. <laughs> Eye of the Storm. Yes! <laughs> Eye of the Storm! You both came out with every variation on that, and finally Linda gets there. So Linda gets the bonus. Let's check the scores at the end of round one. Linda is on 430. It's very close. Glenn is slightly in the lead with 500. <laughs> a long way to go. Talking about a long way to go, if you win today, you could be going a long way somewhere in Europe for a holiday, a luxurious holiday. Glenn, where would you go? I'd like to go to Sicily, Mark. Would you? Why? Um, I like scuba diving, and I've never been to Italy, so combine the two. Oh, is Sicily famous for scuba diving, then? It's got some good dive sites, yeah. Has it? Oh, that'd be great yeah. to go there, then. OK, Linda, where would you go? Porto Penus. In Spain? Yes. Near to Marbella? Yes. It's very, it's very flashy, Linda. <laughs> and it's a bit of glitz and glamour. A bit of glitz and glamour, yes. It's quite an expensive place as well. <laughs> but the sun shines, and you've got yeah. the mountains, you've got the... Oh, yes, lovely. OK, then, that's what they're playing for. Forget that for now, just concentrate on this next round, because each catchphrase is now doubled to 200, and the bonus goes up to 400. Are you ready? Yep. Here's your first one. Glenn. TV chef. Yes. <laughs> so you get the first crack at a new bonus. Pop a balloon. <laughs> Four sheets to the wind. No, but well done. <laughs> he came in quick and he made a catchphrase, even though it was wrong. <laughs> Linda, you're back in. Another catchphrase for you both. <laughs> Linda. Pen and ink. No. <laughs> Go on, Glenn. Pig pen. Yes, pig pen. Well done. <laughs> oh. you see, it's always easier when you have a bit of time, isn't it, Glenn? <laughs> yes. You're on the bonus now. Uh, under the sail? No, it's not under the sail. Quite a good guess, though. Quite a good <laughs> guess. Linda, you're back in. Another catchphrase. Glenn. Shooting from the hip. No. It's all yours, Linda. Shooting stick. Yes, shooting stick. Well done. <laughs> she goes very serious when she answers, doesn't she? <laughs> you can imagine on that darts team really <laughs> concentrating. OK. Wind in the sail. No, it's not wind in the sail. You need to get one of those lower balloons, I think, and that might give it to you. Glenn, you're back in. Right. Here's another catchphrase for 200. <laughs> Glenn? Hot in the middle. No. Linda? Red hot. It is red hot, yes. <laughs> Very well done. Well spotted. OK. Another got the bonus, Linda. <laughs> 
Sale of the Century. Yes, Sale of the Century. That was the balloon you wanted and you got it. Oh, oh. See, it's all on which shape you actually pick. So that's added to your score. Let's look at the scores now. Glenn has 900. Linda's in the lead with 1,170. Yeah. It's a tough battle. Will Linda make it to Puerto Banus? Will Glenn make it to Sicily? Also, Glenn has a very unusual talent, which he's going to practice during the break. I bet you can't wait, can you? See you soon. <laughs> Hi there, welcome back to Catchphrase. Now, I'm not one to brag, but last night, after weeks of trying, I finally got into the world record book. Yeah! Well, it's a very heavy book and I've got weak fingers. <laughs> Dear me. And I bet you have all been absolutely dying to know what Glenn's talent is. Glenn, yeah! reveal to the nation what your talent is. I can move my eyes independently. And here he is to prove it. Do it. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Hasn't that put you off your beans on toes? Honestly, give it a round of applause, though. <laughs> oh, dear. It's what you call football eyes. One at home, one away. <laughs> <laughs> when did you find out you could do that? I can't remember now. A long time ago. Oh, dear. <laughs> anyway, let's check on the scores. Linda, don't be put off by this. You just carry on. You're doing very well because you've, you've got the lead now. Glenn's on 900. Linda is on 1,170. A long way to go. That score can change, of course, because we're about to play. The catchphrase countdown! <laughs> You've got to be quick on the buzzers, guys, because you counted down from 500 to zero very quickly. And for every second that you take to answer, you lose 25. And there's a new bonus in this round as well, and it goes up to 1,000. Are you both ready? Yes. Yes? Here's the first one. Oh, it's all about eyes, Glenn. You should get this. <laughs> Inside the building, they're a bit wet, but outside, they're not wet, so... Dry yeah. eyes. No, Dry not quite. Dry eyes in the house. Dry eyes in the house. Not quite. Make a catchphrase out of it. Glenn? Not a dry eye. eye. Not a dry eye in the house. Yes, you got there. Well done. <laughs> oh. Linda sort of knew what the catchphrase was but couldn't make it. Well done. You get a first crack at the bonus, Glenn. Pick your window. <laughs> <laughs> Funnily enough, it's not that. It's not picky, Linda. Aren't no. uh, you relieved? He said, he said something stupid, Linda. OK, you're back in. Isn't it the catchphrase? Glenn? Baptism of fire. Yes, well done. Very good. You just gambled there and waited a bit till it developed and you got there. So another crack at the bonus, Glenn. Down to 900 now. Men at work? No, it's not men at work, but well done for making a catchphrase. Linda, you're back in. Another countdown catchphrase. <laughs> Glenn. Break the habit. No, not quite. Remember, you can buzz in as often as you like. Glenn. Hard habit to break. Yes, well done. Hard habit to break. 3 2 2 added to your score. So you've gone into the lead, Glenn, and you're on the bonus now. Roadworks. No, it's not Roadworks. <laughs> Linda, you're back in. Another one. Glenn? Shoot the cat? No. <laughs> <laughs> Glenn? Curiosity kill the cat. Yes, well done. <laughs> we wouldn't have shoot the cat. The RSPCA would <laughs> be on to us. <laughs> OK. <laughs> OK, Glenn. Another go at the bonus. Working for the chain gang. <laughs> no, it's not working for the chain gang, but a good guess. Linda, you're back in. Another countdown catchphrase for you both. Oh, there's Mr Chips and he's changed colour. It's a similar... Glenn? Golden vine? No. He's kind of the same colour as something else that you can see there. He must have been on holiday, Linda. Golden cherries? No. Golden cherries? No. 
Glenn. Brown as a berry. Yes! Well done, brown as a berry. <laughs> OK, Glenn, I've never got the bonus. Picking at a symbol. <laughs> Desperate is searching. No, no, it's not. OK, Linda, you're back in. Another catchphrase for you both. Oh. Mr Chips is obviously a bit of a policeman at the moment. And he's asking to see something. <coughs> Linda? Wedding licence. Not wedding licence, no. Linda? Marriage license. Yes, marriage license. Well done. Linda got there. Well done for breaking the run of Glenn because he was on a roll there. So, Linda, you're on the catchphrase bonus now. Working around the clock. Yes! Oh. Working around the clock it is! 500 added to your score. Wow, but it's a real seesaw race. It's Glenn's taking the lead again. Linda's on 1,752. Glenn is on 2,261. <laughs> but concentrate both of you because we've got time for another quick round of the catchphrase countdown. Here's the first one. There's Mr Chips again. And he's gone somewhere. Glenn. Drop into the hatch. No, not quite. Down it's the plug hole. You've got to press what, Linda? Down the plug hole. No, it's not. Glenn? Down the hatch. Yes, down the hatch. I was just going to say when you have a drink, but I didn't need to say it. Well done. OK, Glenn, you get the first go at this bonus. Red flag spells danger. No, it's not red flag spells danger. Oh! There's the cosmic blowout. So we've got to very quickly reveal the shapes one by one. You're playing for the 900 that's in the bonus. Here we go. Glenn. Red rag to a ball. It's not. Glenn. Bulldozer. Yes, bulldozer. Well done. He was so determined to keep that lead, <laughs> and he did. But, Linda, what a show, because you, you were behind, then you were in front, then you were behind again. Let's see the final scores. Linda ends on 1,752, but today's catchphrase champion is Glenn with 3,351. <laughs> oh. And, Linda, because we run short of time, there's not even time for a chat. All I can say is congratulations, because you actually get this. Digital stills camera with six times optical zoom and video capabilities, so now you can email pictures to your mates. All right. OK. Good luck with the darts as well. You've been terrific. Let's hear it for Linda, everybody. <laughs> but, Glenn, you want to go to Sicily, and you can if you win the super catchphrase. <laughs> So you really would love to be scuba diving in Sicily? I would, definitely. Who would you take with you if you went? I'd take Ali, my guest with me today. OK. Because she scuba dives as well, does she? She does, yeah. Well, yeah. she does now, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> if you will. OK, concentrate on the board, because yeah. lurking behind those letters are some catchphrases, and you've got to correctly identify as many catchphrases as you can going across the board. Yeah. If you just don't know what the catchphrases are, or you go wrong, and you go blank, just say pass straight away, don't waste any time. You might have to take an alternative route, which will add to your time, Hopefully you'll get there in the end. You've got right. one minute to get from the left to the right. Can you do it? Try it. Mr. Calm. <laughs> right. Mr. Calm. And just look straight. None of that no. budgie okay. eyes business, OK? <laughs> just you sit Thank down you. there in the hot seat, focus on the board, and you've got 60 seconds to get from the left to the right, Glenn, and then you and Ali will be going scuba diving in Sicily. And your time starts when you give me your first letter. Good luck. Thank you. K. Holding the baby, no. rocking the baby, no. mother, mother of pearl. Yes, well done. L. Box card of a box, talking box. A very talkative. Uh, uh, talk, uh, chat very, box. Yes, well done. M. Bridge, burn your bridges. Yes. Don't burn your bridges. N. Oh, He's going from one to the other. Head, one head to the other, top to, top to tail, head, head, hair to hair. Pass. Yes, yes, you've said it, you've said oh. it. Head to head, yes, well done. O. Join the line. It's not the end beginning. of the line. Yes, end of the line, well done. Oh, oh, well done. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. And here's your friend Ali as well. Oh, marvellous. <laughs>
very good. You said it had to, had to, had to, had to, had to, had to. You did say it. You did say it. Congratulations. Thank you. You get those travel documents, which will take you all the way to Sicily. Plus, we're going to give you two hundred and fifty pounds as well. What do you think of him? Fantastic. He's always got a smile on his face as well, is not he? Which is great. You've been terrific. Well done. Thank you. Won the race at the end. Yeah. Congratulations. That's it from Catchphrase for today. More catchphrases right here. See you soon. Bye. Pointless next on challenge, more mind-bendingly fascinating facts with contestants looking to score as few points as possible. Tonight at 8 over on PIC, it's Stargate SG-1. Sit tight and prepare to be hurled into hyperspace.